But first, we are tracking the latest developments in the school arrest protests. Ten people taken into custody in Pawtucket. It happened during a demonstration against the arrest yesterday of two other students. Those arrests were caught on camera inside Tolman High School. That video sent to us by a viewer. And tonight, state police are probing the takedown. Eyewitness News reporter Perry Russum joins us now from Pawtucket with the latest information. State and local police are investigating what happened here outside of the school. Students protested, were pepper sprayed, and arrested Thursday morning. Police arrested 10 people outside of Tolman High School. The three and a half hour protest across the street from the school escalated to this. I'm asking you to do the right thing, go back to school. It all started on Wednesday when this video was recorded in school. It shows a Pawtucket police officer using a takedown move on a student. Two teens were arrested after police say they attacked an officer. Donald Grebian is the mayor of Pawtucket. They wanted to be heard on this issue. You want to protest, be my guest. And they did it in a peaceful way. It did get a little bit out of control at some point. He said he was going to it's our job to, you know, make sure that everybody, again, is, is safe in a safe environment. The student-run protest moved to City Hall, where the mayor was set to talk to a group of students about the video. Tension continued to tighten outside, ending with police using pepper spray. The mayor also referred to it as tear gas. Students used bottled water to clear their eyes. Tear gas is, is harmless. I mean, it burns, don't get me wrong, uh, but they sprayed it in there, but it's not something where somebody is seriously injured. The superintendent says an alert was sent home to parents saying their kids are safe and they have school on Friday. In Pawtucket with the Mobile Newsroom, Perry Russell, Eyewitness News.